Rituals are an important part of all our lives. Going through ritual processes help us take on new identities and roles. Rituals also provide us with the means to move away from our old identities. This occurs as a liminal stage, an in-between space that provides us with the opportunity to separate from our old identities, as well as to learn our new values, information and ideals of our new identity and positions that we reintegrate back into our communities with. Now, say what happens if something disrupts this ritual process, something such as a global pandemic of government-mandated lockdown orders. Hi, my name is Kelsey Never, and I'm a master's student in the Anthropology Department at Rose University. Universities can be understood as liminal spaces. As an individual, you enter, and by the time you obtain a degree that represents the skills and information that you've learned, you also gain a new identity as a graduate. Universities are also spaces with communities that individuals undergo rituals to become a member of, that is, to become a student. These are either short once of initiation rituals, such as through the official orientation programs or legal hazing into specific groups within the university community, or long-term incorporation into academic life, as this is by academic and social life-focused programs run by the university to ease process of becoming a student. Undergoing these rituals are regarded as positive experiences, providing students a sense of belonging as well as entry into the community support network of their peers. From March 2020, COVID-19 has forced universities to reconsider how they engage in university activities in a social distance world with changes of government lockdown levels and restrictions. A hybrid approach to online classes with some on-campus activities or how academic activity occurs currently but academic activity is only one aspect of university student life. My research aims to look at the effects that COVID-19 has had on Rose University first-year students in corporation rituals into academic community. I want to find out from first-year undergraduate students who started university in the years 2020, 2021 and 2022, the experiences of coming to university, of their expectations of what it is to be a student in comparison to their reality, and how the COVID-19 might have impacted on this reality. Additionally, the experiences of staff members, both academic and involved in other aspects of student life, who facilitate in the orientation process will also be collected to look at how they responded to the challenges of keeping student activities as COVID safe as possible, while also trying to remain a sense of normalcy.